Welcome back to SSP TV News presented by Samsung Productions and the Hazleton Standard Speaker. And now here's your weekly community feature. We have a big event happening in on Main Street in Cunningham this coming Saturday. It's called Christmas in Cunningham. And my sister-in-law is with us to talk about the details. We are co-chairing again this year. Last year was a blur. We started this in 2019 when we took it over. And Lori, this year we have some fun things planned. We really do, Janine. I'm very excited because, you know, in my house, gingerbread house making is like the absolute tradition of Christmas. Without them, it just isn't the same. So we're having a gingerbread house competition this year that is being sponsored by the Brass Buckle. So we're very excited to partner with them on this event. And you can check out our Facebook page so that you can find all the details. But pretty much the simple thing is it has to be 100% edible. So that means you can't cheat like I sometimes do at home and use some hot glue and different things. It has to be edible uh, and you need to have it in. You have to bring it the day of. You have to have it to the brass buckle by 11 a.m. so that they can be judged in time. The parade starts at noon and it's going to be uh, on Main Street. Uh, any information that you need, you can go to our website, christmasincunningham.weebly.com. Uh, dot com and you can see uh, the forms are at the bottom um, of the screen if you want to participate but it's the parade and then down Main Street we will go right right and then we'll go into the park where there's going to be yeah. lots of things going on there as well lots of exciting stuff happening at the park we have many different vendors between craft vendors and small business vendors, food vendors. We have Pierogi Joe and his mini donuts will be there. Trips Barbecue is coming. Country Heart Farm will be there with uh, some animals that you'll be able to check out. We have Early Poli who will be with us. Um, there, there's a 31 consultant, just so many wonderful things to pick from. So you can get all your shopping for Christmas done in one place and you can support all of our local vendors, which is really nice. And we have live entertainment in the park, tricky trays, uh, which the funds for everything that we're doing this year is for the uh, Valley Food Pantry, as well as the Cunningham CBCO. All right, so again, we will see you if you have any information that you need from us. Uh, we have the Facebook page, but we also have the website. Um, special thanks to our board this year. We have Sherry Homanko. Um, we have Brian Early, we have Joe Stanavage Jr., we have Angela Conahan, and Jerry Sewell, who is the owner of the Brass Buckle. Um, we'd like to thank the CBCO because they are helping this year with the, the Tricky Tray Baskets. But like you said, all the money that we raise this year will be going to support all of the good things that the Cunningham Valley uh, Civic Organization does, not only for Cunningham, but for the greater um, good of the valley. So they do are involved with so many things. Um, I interviewed them recently on uh, the girls and they uh, were great. They talked about how much they do for the area and Valley Food Pantry too. Um, if there is a need, um, you can reach out to the Valley Food Pantry as well. Um, any specific needs for Thanksgiving or Christmas, they put things together, whether you want to donate or if you need services this year with everything that happened with the pandemic, I know that the need is quite larger than usual. Yeah, and Janine, you know, I have to say the best part about planning Christmas in Cunningham, as busy as everybody is, it's so wonderful to see everybody come together as a community. And I really missed that last year with everything going on. So this year, it's going to be an even bigger and better celebration than it's been in the past because I think it's so much more meaningful now that we can come back together again. Right, and even if you're an adult, you can still bring out the kid in you. I know we'll have our new Christmas leggings on. I'm like, hmm, what am I gonna wear to this? Something festive, it doesn't even have to match because it's Christmas. Just wear something festive, bring your dogs to the parade yeah. if you like. It is pet friendly, so you can bring your pooches, you can dress them up. If you like, bring your babies out, bundle them up in their Christmas attire, and you can have a visit with Santa Claus and Mrs. Claus. Um, so in closing, Lori, anything else? Just make sure you start making your gingerbread houses. Get your 
wallets full because we have lots of shopping to do and fantastic food for you to try with all of our very many vendors that we're very grateful for. December 4th, Christmas in Cunningham. We'll see you there.